New numbers have just been released in the 41st Congressional District race. The Republican incumbent Ken Calvert has already declared victory, doing that after last night's latest results were released. And today, his lead has widened again, still with about 52% of the vote, but the margin is now up to 6,500 votes. Democrat Will Rollins has not conceded. News Channel 3's Bianca Ventura shares this reaction from both camps. Although the race for the 41st Congressional District has been called by the Associated Press, Democratic candidate Will Rollins has not conceded. In a statement to News Channel 3, Rollins shared in part, quote, Last night's news was not what we hoped for. We know we face an uphill climb, but I have always been adamant that the Democratic process must play out. With many votes still outstanding, the next round of ballots released this evening will provide more insight on where this race stands, end quote. Ellie Kurpuski, political director for the Democratic headquarters of the desert, shares her initial thoughts on the race. Disappointment um, and hope. Um, I think this young man, Will Rollins, ran one of the best campaigns I've seen. I think he is bright. I think he is uh, intelligent. I think he is caring. And frankly, we're hoping he'll stick around and run against Mr. Calvert in 24. Joy Medici, president of the Republican Women's Club, had this to say about Congressman Calvert's lead. Well, obviously, our country has been out of balance for the last two years, so it gives us hope. And I th really think it's all about hope. Congressman Calvert shared this in part in regards to his projected victory. Quote, I will work to take our country in a different direction from the path it's on and advocate for policies that will curb inflation, lower energy prices by increasing American production, address our border crisis, and reduce crime. End quote. Meanwhile, Democrats are looking towards the races they were able to secure. But we have to look at the fact that we did elect, re-elect Congressman Ruiz overwhelmingly. Uh, Eduardo Garcia for state assembly, Christy Hull stage for state assembly. You realize we have two Democrats going to the state assembly from this area. And due to redistricting, Calvert now has a foot in the desert. I, I know he's going to be hands on in our area. He will be coming to the desert a lot and he'll be listening to us. So that's what we need is somebody who listens to us. In Thousand Palms, Bianca Ventura, News Channel 3. And you can find the full statements from Calvert and Rollins at KESQ.com. Again, Rollins has not conceded. He did indicate he had more to say about the results after tonight's update. Stay with News Channel 3 on the air and online at KESQ.com for any new developments on that.